back with another video. This holiday shopping season, I decided to do something different and make it about yourself. This one's a little bit different than last week. Today we're doing a shoe review. We're looking at a pair of dress shoes, a good example of a pair of dress shoes that would look great with any outfit this holiday season. If you're going over to someone's house, like a family member, or maybe for a work party. If you want to just change up your style, this is a pretty inexpensive option and Target is a pretty good place to go. These were $45. These are the Gerard boots. I'm going to call them Jared, but if we actually look at the side of the box, it says Gerard, J-E-R-A-D, which is actually kind of the opposite of how you would spell Jared. Items, clothing items at Target typically involve a name like a Christopher or an Alex and then they apply that to whatever article of clothing or pair of shoes it is. With this particular pair of boots, it's the Gerard boot. Why not the Jared? Not sure. But 45 bucks and actually upon initial first impressions, they're brand new. Haven't been worn before, haven't been touched before. I can tell because the packaging is perfect on the inside. And as you can see, both shoes are attached. You have to cut them apart, which is also how I know they're brand new. But I was able to get them in my size, a size 11, which is what I typically wear. So this should be a pretty good review to find out if dress shoes at Target are true to size, how well they fit. This should be a pretty good example. But also what makes this review a good example for men's dress shoes this holiday shopping season is this is a style I think you should look for in a pair of boots slash dress shoes. By the way, they are boots, but I think you could dress them up. So let's actually start with the first impressions and then of course stick around till the end of the video so we can try them on. But let's start with the first impressions. So first impressions, this is a pair of boots that you can dress up. And the reason I know you can dress them up as opposed to, say, take them to a construction job, for example, or maybe go hiking in them, or maybe walk through the snow in them. What differentiates this boot, what makes it a dress boot compared to those other types of boots I just mentioned is, well, first and foremost, Target is a pretty casual place if you're shopping for clothing, not the type of place you would get heavy duty equipment. Second, I think what makes this a dress boot is if you look at the ankle collar here, it's pretty thin. The entire upper half of the shoe is this leather like material. It's thin, should fit comfortably, but usually with a work boot, you get a padded collar and you also get different material. It's usually a combination of leather and nylon, so it can breathe and it's water resistant. This does not have water resistance. Let's go ahead and take a look at the bottom of the boot. You can see it's got a pretty nice, about a quarter of an inch thick heel, and then it's tapered off at the front. It's got a nice round toe, pretty standard for a boot with pretty decent tread at the front of the shoe for getting through maybe some of those more inclement conditions this winter season. You've got nice treading there. But most importantly, what makes this a dress boot, dress shoe laces, which is good to see because if anything happens to them, you can replace them. Also, since this is a boot, it should meet some form of expectation, right? It should serve a purpose. It should offer some utility.
And so, what I am curious to find out, if maybe you do walk through the snow, get caught in the rain, how easy is it to take care of these? Can you wash them? Can you clean them? Do they dry out easily? And one thing I've noticed here that I dislike is this boot has a non-removable foot orthotic, meaning if I wanted to take out the foot orthotic and dry the inside of the shoe better, or maybe wash the orthotic in the washing machine and maybe remedy a foul odor from having made contact with water, that is not a possibility here. So a bit of a drawback and potentially the reason they cost $45. Just keep that in mind. But again, what I think that also says is not much of a work shoe or something you would use for utility purposes. Rather, like I said at the beginning of the video, something you would dress up, go out in. And what makes this a nice shoe to go out in? Well, first and foremost, it's got a pretty nice light tan upper, so you can really dress this. You could pair it with pretty much anything. But it also, at the same time, has a darker appearance, and that is in large part thanks to the black and dark brown sole. Overall, looking at the shoe, really good quality control. I don't see any issues with the fit or finish here. In fact, this looks nothing like a $45 dress boot. This looks more expensive than that. It's simple, no branding, which is also in line with more expensive dress shoes and boots. So thank you Target for giving us a really nice looking shoe and it only costs $45. But like I said, this looks absolutely phenomenal. I don't see any issues with it, except for the fact I haven't tried it on yet. So what we need to do is try it on because for all I know, it could be extremely uncomfortable. Yeah, it looks the business. Yeah, it only cost $45. Yes, I was able to find my size, but what if it doesn't fit right? And so that's what we're gonna find out. Now let's go ahead and see how it fits. Okay guys, now for my first impressions on foot. In the video, wearing them, you can see just how stylish and attractive they are. Really sharp looking. I actually wore them with black ankle socks to prove my point from earlier. This is not a work boot, this is a dress boot. And you can see with black ankle socks, it looks just a little off, it looks weird, it looks maybe inappropriate, it looks out of style, out of touch. Had I been wearing a pair of work boots with black ankle socks, I think obviously that would have worked better, it would have proven my point, but I was able to prove my point about these being dress boots by wearing the black ankle socks. I think with a pair of dress socks you can see in the try on, and also the fact I'm not wearing pants, I'm wearing shorts is more reason that you would buy these to wear them to a party, to dress them up, wear them with a pair of slacks and a pair of dress socks. But I digress. You can see just how sharp and attractive they are without paying attention to the ankle socks or the fact that I'm wearing shorts. And what gives them their attractive, sharp appearance is how long they are. Compared to other dress shoes I've reviewed in the past, these are long. Actually, wearing them, they felt supportive, yes, they were comfortable, had a comfortable foot orthotic, yes, but like I said, they did feel long. My toe was actually pretty much right at this crease here. This is a size 11. Size 11 is what I typically wear. I have a size 11 running shoe from Nike and it fits snug as a bug in a rug. Like I said, this is a long shoe and my toe was basically at this crease right here and I did feel that I had room in, a little bit further up into the toe. Now, even though it's a rounded toe, not a whole lot of space there, I think, again, what makes this shoe attractive, what gives it its sharp looking appearance is the fact that it is longer, noticeably longer on foot. 
but also that is interesting because if you're a size 12, you can wear this. If you're a size 11 and a half, even though this is a size 11, you should be able to wear it. And actually, it should be even more comfortable for you. It should fit just a little bit tighter, a little snuglier, and overall feel just more secure and firm on the foot. For me, it was just a little bit on the longer side. That being said, it does give it an attractive appearance. So anyways guys, that was my first impressions on foot. With that, let's conclude this video. They were comfortable, stylish, no quality control issues whatsoever. This is a really good example for $45. This should be what you seek out in other dress boots this holiday shopping season. Dress boots for the holiday season is a great style, is a great way to go. And if you're on a budget, actually just want to pick these up and wear them and change it up a little bit this year, this season, check out the Gerard dress boot at Target. It was only $45, really good quality, sharp looking shoe. It fit great. Like I said, just a little bit long, but otherwise it was really comfortable. I didn't find any issues with the width of the shoe or the height of the shoe. Target, like I said, great place to go for casual wear so you can be confident in the fact this is a good option for wearing for dressing up my name is john thanks again so much for tuning in hit that like button subscribe comment down below for more hit the bell icons get notified when we post to youtube share this video with friends and family thanks again so much for tuning in stay tuned for our next review